Widevine L1 issues on POCO devices need to be reported to the app. Well, yep, that is the answer which we've gotten from Alvin and we of course made a video about Widevine L1 issues on the POCO F1. Sent out a tweet to the Anud Sharmas, the Manu Kumar Jains, over 600 retweets. No response from them. Why? Because Indians, we are more interested in selling the device rather than providing customer care and bragging about being number one in the world. But when it comes to customer care, number zero. Anyways, so Alvin was helping us out and engineers were working on it ever since he responded. And today somebody asked him for an update. And this is the update we got already done for a couple of models. Should see L1 in the system, but some apps still don't support due to lack of certification. Need the apps to certify, not in our control. Users can message the apps to ask them to start certification. If many users ask, they might start. And I did ask him if that meant we have to report the issue to Amazon and Netflix because English not being my first language, but that is what I understood from here. Need the apps to certify not in their control. So there is your answer. If you want L1 on POCO devices, you have to report the issue to either Netflix or Amazon Prime, whichever application L1 is not working for you, as long as your device is L1 certified, which of course you can use the DRM info application to check whether it is L1 certified or not. Now coming to my opinion, my opinion for starters, hats off to Alvin for at least responding. Indian people, they didn't even respond. There was this dude from IIM who blocked me and called it mob mentality. So that is the thought process of Indian people. And I am an Indian and I am criticizing Indians. So no need to get offended about it that he called out Indian people as useless or anything like that. But we should also appreciate when somebody helps us. So of course, hats off and thanks to Alvin for responding in the first place. But again, not in our control is, in my humble opinion, a useless response. When the POCO F1 launched, you got it certified from Prime, right? Netflix never certified it, but you as a company got it certified from Amazon Prime and that is how POCO F1 got wide wine L1. So now if it is not working for a multitude of devices across multiple regions, that is Indian, Global, POCO X3 Pro, POCO M3, POCO M2, POCO F1, whatever POCO devices, how can you come and say that you contact the app Shouldn't you as a company be taking ownership of your device? I mean, certification processes between you and the company, right? When I bought the device, it was working. So now if it is not working, it is you who need to fix it. And again, this is my personal opinion and feel free to bash me in the comments for stating my personal opinion. But at this point, I really don't care about POCO India and POCO Global and their bullshit practices wherein they give you L1 for two years and then take it away and then ask you to contact Amazon Prime or Netflix so that they can certify it. It is your responsibility as the OEM to fix it. So grow a pair and man up and do what you're supposed to do and those of you who do have l1 issues i think you have no other option other than to report it to netflix and amazon prime and hope they fix it and contact the customer cares i think if a bunch of you contact complain might change something if not then it is what it is